Hello Libras. This is your reading for the 2nd through the 3rd. This is for Libra, Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus, and Jupiter signs. If you guys are new, welcome to the channel. Please hit the like button, share the video, and subscribe, guys. Thank you. This reading will not resonate for everyone. Excuse me. So, I would suggest you guys, you know, take out of it what resonates with you and um, leave the rest, okay? Don't try to make it fit if it doesn't. All right, my Libras, let's see what we've got. We've got the Nine of Swords. A lot of you are really thinking about, um, you know, how to how to move into a better space. Like, I, I think a lot of you are overthinking situations and really kind of contemplating things and trying to figure things out. You're in this moment of, like really looking back at the past and and try to make sure you don't repeat like things that brought you heartache or discomfort before yeah you're trying to figure out you know the right thing to do in this situation currently you know weighing the scales you know, weighing your options even here okay could be another libra like yourself or it could be a gemini you guys are involved with does not have to be yeah i feel like you're stuck around this um you really just don't know what to do because in one sense you want to do you know what's best for you and then you also want to do what's best for the other person that's involved here okay or a situation that you're involved in like you want to do what's right for everybody involved and you're not wanting to make the wrong decision. So you're really trying to like look inside of yourself to make sure that you're doing the right thing for everybody involved here, okay? Piscean energy there. Then we have the seven of wands. And I feel like you guys just really, you know, do not want to be bothered. You don't want anyone's input, really. Um, you want to try to figure this thing out on your own. But you know what it is that you want and what you expect from a situation, from a person. And you're just not willing to accept anything less. Um, I get the sense that, you know, you're, you're kind of blocking someone out here too. Um, Leo energy. Um, defending, defending who you are and what you believe in. Okay? Because, you know, it's like you have the confidence within yourself to know that there are certain things that you're not going to put up with, certain things that's going to drag you down, bring you down even, and you just not want to deal with it. The Ace of Coins. Hmm. A lot of you are contemplating whether or not, you know, there there's an offer on the table, I feel, and you're not sure about it. Because I feel like, you know, certain situations in the past probably kind of resemble this situation and you're really just not trying to get caught up in anything that's going to even resemble what you've been through before okay and so you're trying to figure out you know if this if this is something that's good for you okay then you have the five of wands yeah you're really trying to figure this out i feel like you know, you're having a lot of, of conflict around this decision that you're trying to make here. You're struggling with it. Maybe, um, you know, this situation has been stuck for you before in the past. You feel like it wasn't going anywhere. And you don't think it's going anywhere now. And that's just how you feel about it. And so you're kind of blocking this energy um, from anyone else like you're not having it you're not going to be in a stuck situation it's just not you're just not with it okay but you're you're still conflicted about what to do because you don't want to do the wrong thing i feel because you feel like there will be repercussions whatever that means you know two of swords yeah you are indecisive. You're not sure what to do in this situation. You're not sure if you're actually making the right decision um, by not allowing this individual into your space. Okay? You're just not sure. 
you're conflicted about it. You're thinking a lot about it, I feel. The Four of Wands here. Hmm. Trying to decide whether this offer is a legitimate offer that would lead to a commitment that would, you know, bring you happiness here. Could you be happy with this person? Should you give this a chance? Should you push through this energy of feeling like maybe it's going to be stuck? Maybe there's going to be um, a cycle that's repeated? Um, you're, you're giving us a lot of thought. Okay. Aries energy there. Then we have a three of wands. Yeah. It's, yeah. It's like this. is Okay. So there's a situation here where there's an offer on a table currently. But you're not sure of this. Okay. You're not sure about it. You're not sure if it's going to resemble um, a situation or situations that you guys experienced before in the past. And, and something about the situation is making you feel like it would lead to that like it's gonna you know be like a repeated cycle okay but at the same time it's like you're not sure if you're jumping the gun with thinking that because you know this could be a very long-term relationship one where you guys can really grow this ace of pentacles into the ten of pentacles here that you possibly could be happy with this person in a stable relationship but at the same time, you're feeling, no, I don't think I can deal with this, okay? Maybe there's something better out there for me, is where you're currently at. And then, as I get ready to shuffle, I see the Ten of Cups under the bottom of the deck. So, you know, this is a situation where you really want, you want affirmation. You want confirmation that this is going to be successful. It's going to be something that is fulfilling for you. And that's what you're struggling with here. That's what you're thinking about. That's what you're fighting with yourself about. I feel like, um, you know, you guys have maybe had a conversation about this. And I don't feel like you you think you guys are on the same page here. You feel like it's going to be a very stuck situation, very stagnant situation here. Then we have the Eight of Coins. You're thinking about working on this. You're thinking about... You're thinking about either working on it or being by yourself, working on yourself, concentrating on yourself here. It's like this is you getting your stability, being in a relationship with this person, being happy with this person, walking through this door, accepting this offer here, or either waiting on something else that you feel like is better suited for you here with the Three of Wands. Both of these are Aries cards here. Okay. So there's a question question of whether or not you want to build with this person or you want to continue working on yourself and waiting on something um, better suited for you here. Okay, so we have Virgo energy here, Aries, Leo, um, Piscean energy, Gemini energy. Okay, so my Leos, my Leos, sorry guys, my Libras is what I have for you guys and I will be speaking with you soon.